Right, if Wellingtown man of the match and O'Neill is going to sing a song for us now. Um, Adam, I said to Dan, um, the defeat and a 2 0 scoreline is, is harsh on us today. Yeah, it's. Um it's been a couple of weeks now, two weeks in a row that we've we've gone toe to toe with two of the best sides in the league, and um, whether it's a bit of cutting edge we've lacked, or a bit of fitness maybe, or just uh, not gone had the run run of the ball, um, you know we've just come up short a couple of times. But um, you know the gaffer said like he's proud of us, and, and uh, you know we've we've put everything into the last couple of weeks, and um, yeah, I mean it's it's um, you know we we've got our heads up, you know we're not down about it. I think. Um, you know, we reflect on two good performances, two unlucky defeats, and um, you know we'll, we'll keep going. Is it too easy to say that we're not taking chances and we're not we're not getting in front of things? I think it's correct. Um, you know, and I look at myself, and uh, you know, I haven't really had my shooting boots on the last couple of weeks, and some of the boys have been giving me some stick about it. Uh, I can only shoot when there's a dead ball situation, but yeah, I mean it's fair. You know, we have we haven't uh, we haven't put our chances away, and ultimately, you know, football's a simple game. You you score, you win games. You don't concede, you you win games. Um, and it's, it's tight margins against against good sides. You you have to put your chances away. You don't get many good chances, and you've got to be clinical. And um, unfortunately, we've just come up short the last couple of weeks. And I think you can stretch it back to maybe four or five weeks. You know. Um, Going back a couple of months, we were scoring for fun, and the goals have dried up a bit. And um, you know, we're, we're not. I'm not entirely sure why. Sometimes these things just happen. It hasn't quite been clicking for us in the final third. But um, the performances are there, so you know, I've got faith that the goals will come back. We've got enough quality. To come away to a side that were top of the league and cruising, and our midfield to play how they did in the first half and causing problems. We got on the ball. You know, we were knocking it about. Well, we were creating chances. We were pushing them back, and we're the away team. Yeah, that must show you how far we've come, and that we are a decent side at this level. Absolutely, like I said, toe to toe in just about all areas of the pitch. I think probably 60, 70 minutes into the game, we've you know we've we've lost our legs a bit in the sense that you know they've probably got a bit 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 of the edge on the fitness side. Um, I think that showed a bit. But yeah, first half, um, I thought we, we were the better side in many ways. We de we definitely dominated the midfield. Um, the gap started to show a bit in the second half, and uh, you know they're a team with with a, with a lot of good players and players that played at high level. Um, and I think you know maybe that's where that that fitness level comes in is they've just you know they've they've been drilled well their whole lives and they've trained well and um, you know they've got good wingers and um, I think the gap started to show and the wingers exploited that and un unfortunately you know we just uh, we just they just edged us out in the end. Yeah, I said to Danny, over half of their side, probably most of their side, have played Conference South, which is not just one level or two levels above, it's three levels above. So, yeah. you know, they are, they have got quality players. But the fact Absolutely. that we did, we could have easily took the lead in that game up to 70 minutes and, you know, you'd have fancied us to see it out. So, Absolutely. nothing to fear wherever we go. Absolutely, we are so nearly there, you know. Um, this week and last week, if, if the game had just, if we'd have taken a chance here or if we'd have... You know, if we'd have just uh, made the right pass here and there, you know, we could become, we could be in the next round of the Vars, and we could have beaten the best team in the league away. So, we're so close, but I think we know that, you know, and we're not being too hard on ourselves. Um, you know, we don't have nearly the budget that someone like, you know, a club like Beckenham Town do, and and we're, we're so close. So, um, yeah, as, as, as I said, Gaffer's proud of us, and you know, I'm proud of the boys. We worked so hard, we worked so hard again today, and. Um, yeah, you know, it was, it was a good performance. It was a good performance. I think we might have lacked a little bit of intensity against Punjab, Adam, but I think the last two performances, we've been absolutely on it. And if we're on it every game and we have got the quality, there's not many games we're going to lose in this league. No, agreed. Um, Punjab, we were poor. We accepted that. Um, and... You know, we've lost three games in a row now, um, but it doesn't feel like we have. You know, we haven't been three bad performances. Um, so as, that's why we're not too down. <laughs> Uh, but it's um, it, you know it's a long season and we went on an um, amazing run, 11 unbeaten or 10 unbeaten in the league. So you're going to lose some games, especially against the top sides in the league. And um, you know the, the feeling's good in the dressing room, as I said. Uh, you know we, we'll, we'll stay positive. And we'll be going to Canterbury on Saturday looking to get the three points. Yeah, yeah. We, I mean we've we've got a run of tough games, um, so you know we're really testing ourselves. Um, We'll get back on the, you know, we'll, we'll train on Thursday night and uh, we'll go again. You know, I don't think we've done too much wrong today, so I don't think too much needs to change. We just perhaps maybe a bit of shooting practice on Thursday night. Well, I think you could have had about eight interviews this season, so we finally tracked you down for one. 
Well uh, done, my man. And that's appreciate that. Uh, thanks for coming to see us, and we'll see you Saturday. Thanks, Tom. Look forward to it. Cheers.